Today I'm at the University of Sydney with Dr. Phil and we're talking about the pressure that all of us are under. You are under a lot of pressure, probably 10,000 kilograms. 10,000 kilograms is pressing in on my whole body. All from all sides. Where does all this pressure come from? It's from the air. <laughs> that looks like a dance move. Is that I'm, what you pull I'm, out on the I'm dance I'm lifting 10,000 kilograms You're of air. You're lifting the air. Now, uh, How much air is there above us? About 20 kilometers or so. So you're at the bottom of an ocean of air. So essentially the weight of the air is squishing me in. That's right. Just and, and all of us, you too. And me too. Wow. You seem to be holding up rather well though. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> How do you do it? What is well, your I've secret? Well, I've got this special trick. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. I've got the same amount of pressure inside me. Okay. So since the pressure is equal inside and outside of you, you're in equilibrium and there's no sort of crushing or expansion. No, that's right. Okay. That's right. Well, most people, I think, don't recognize the pressure that they're under. Yeah. At least due to the atmosphere. That's right. How can we demonstrate that the atmosphere is exerting this huge pressure on well, everyone? The best thing to do is to scoop out their insides and then there'll be no pressure on the inside and then they'll be... Crushed, crushed by the atmosphere. By the atmosphere. And that will be a rather clear demonstration exactly. of the power of the atmosphere. Exactly. But let's say we didn't want to kill anyone. Uh, how could we demonstrate this in, say, a lab? Well, we could take a model of a person. And this drum is meant to be a model of a person. That's correct. Yeah. Okay. And so, um, so what are we going to do with it? So what, what we're going to do yeah, go ahead. is we're going to put some water in here. Why don't we go ahead and do it? Okay. Let's do it. it heating up. Stove so we've got some water in the drum and we're heating it up on this uh, little gas stove here. That's right. Okay. And what is that doing for us? So the water will heat up and begin to boil. So it'll turn from liquid into a vapor. That vapor will push out some of the air. Okay. So basically we're going to remove the air from inside the drum and replace it with water vapor. That's right. Okay. Okay. Then once we're sure that it's pretty much emptied of air, we put the stopper in mm -hmm. and cool it back down again. Okay, so that's gonna condense the water vapor. That's right. And so what does that do to the pressure inside the drum? It'll become much smaller. Okay, and then we're gonna be able to see what the atmosphere does when there's no pressure on the inside Pushing to push it. out. Excellent. Exactly. All right, well, I'll look forward to that. All right. So wh how long do we have to wait for this uh, to boil and get all sorted? A uh, couple of minutes. Mm -hmm. Should we do a little time-lapse effect? Let's do that. All right. Okay, it looks like we're <laughs> boiling away furiously here, which All right. is pretty good. So uh, it's about time to perform the experiment. Let's do it. I bet it might be a bit dramatic, so I'm going to uh, chuck on a bit of gear. Safety glasses are always important. Yeah. And safety gloves to avoid burning your hands on this uh, very hot drum. That's right. Now, uh, you might want to... You want to put those on? I will. You might want to stand back a bit because it's a little bit dramatic what happens. All right. Let's do it. Get the vent mixer there and get some cold water onto it. All right, so that water's turning back into water vapor. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> That's what you look like with uh, 3,000 kilograms on your head, 10,000 kilograms on your whole body. You know what I was expecting? I was expecting it to crumple like slowly over time. I wasn't expecting it to just go all in once. Yeah, well, because it's circular, a little bit of it goes and the whole lot goes. Wow. They're quite, they're quite strong for a while. Yeah, that was awesome. Yeah, you can hear the air is trying to get back in. And now the pressure is e equalized there. The, inside <laughs> the pressure is now re-equalized, that's right. Wow, that's one hell of an experiment. It certainly is. Looks like you wet yourself, that was so exciting. <laughs> <laughs> that's partly true. <laughs>